right guys, today I am out in front of my own house. I brought the rig out here. Wanted to see what it looked like with the, uh, the um, awning down there. And I also wanted to make sure that it didn't have any kind of tears or anything in it. I know we got a uh, tree there. <laughs> but you can see there are no tears. It's a little bit dirty, but that's all right. And there was some water whenever I uh, let it out. All the water ran out, so. But it looks pretty good there. It was actually pretty easy to put out, and I did not film that part. But basically, you know, you just pull out the, the arms on each side, and then you get a hold of the thing in the middle and pull it down. And I'm going to put that back up now that I see that it looks good because I don't like it hanging out over here. All right, good. I got that up. I know I should have filmed it, but I wanted to uh, really focus on what I was doing there because I, I it's spring-loaded, and I didn't want it to just be like and you know slam up against there and I was thinking about my camera and what it was filming so uh all right well let's go inside a minute I want to get the mattress out of here and I'm going to wash down the uh, the bedroom area back there at least before I close up for the day the first thing I want to do though I want to be able to put this uh this slide out from the bedroom here for a minute because I need to check and see I got my extra tire out, I got my little giant ladder in there, and what I need to see is when I put this slide out, is there anything that this stuff is going to be obstructing in there. It doesn't look like it, but I just want to make sure with that tire out, because I won't, if, if it does, if that tire obstructs it, then that means that when I try to put the slide out, it'll push the tire out, which will damage that door. So let's try that real quick here. Okay. I gotta get used to the sounds that these slides make. Cause it feels, I mean it's, cause it's kind of scary. I keep expecting something to like just totally crunch. <laughs> All right, yeah, that's looking good. Let's look up under here. Yep doesn't uh, I was afraid that something inside there would push forward but it's not so we're good to go okay there we go tires back in and that thing is heavy <laughs> it was not easy okay now while I got this thing over here at my house I want to get the old mattress out of there because I did buy a new one that you will see very soon Okay, mattress is out. Let's go see how much room we got back here. What all we got to clean up. Okay. That's what it looks like without the mattress. <laughs> There's actually a ton of room back here. Look at that. That opens that up huge. That's about 12 feet wall to wall. Look at all the storage space under the bed there. And then there's these little things here to give us access to, I guess that's the power to the slide there, if it ever needs to be uh, fixed. So this is like a shoe holder thing. It's canvas, just connects right to the bottom of the bed here. But I'm gonna take that out because it's pretty grungy and gross. easy enough all right got that stuff out of there a bucket full of mr. clean with gain ah smells so good <laughs> yeah I want to wash down every bit of everything in here that can possibly be washed down
whooped. That's about 90% of the bedroom. I washed down everything, including in every one of those drawers, in everything, and uh, swept this floor several times, cracks and crevices, because there were mice in here at one point. So there are tiny little mouse turds in several places, <laughs> but I'm getting them cleaned up, and once I can actually tear out this carpet here, and, uh, and really sweep it and clean it out good, then, you know, then yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> so I can't believe it's January and it's like 61 degrees right now. I'm burning up in here. I did check all of these plugs. That one, that one, another one over here, another one over here. Those all work, but this one here does not. So I'm gonna have to figure out why that one's not working. We'll get it working eventually. Still have the old uh, seat in the shower there. That's going to stay there for the moment. Got a couple of boxes up here I'm going to get rid of that the fireplace and that came in. I wanted to put the new mattress down today, but there are a whole bunch of staples in here that I'm going to have to pull out first because the last people who had it stapled some of those non-slip pads to the platform there, and I don't want to tear up my mattress, so I'm going to have to take those out first, but it's going to have to wait. I'm a tired boy, so all right, guys shutting it down and uh, stick around a lot more coming brand new furniture all throughout brand new floors all throughout this is gonna get fun guys see you later